and alone and uh, serotonin, for example, would be two things that could be suppressed during TRT, then those could negatively impact confidence. It might change his personality even too, like you know, a whole ton different than he is now, like maybe worse or than he is. I don't know. Who knows? <laughs> well, I think a lot of the problem really with guys like that is they don't realize what steroids actually do for you, right? Like the, it's all about the work ethic and the way you eat when it comes to bodybuilding, right? So, I mean, steroids, assuming you're not running trend or you're around with Anadrol or something, assuming you're running a normal human use, <laughs> a dose of steroids, it's only going to give you what, maybe 15 or 20% more more of what you'd already get based on your diet and exercise, right? Like it's not going to do the work for you. You still have to do the work. You still have to eat healthy. If you're not doing those things, the steroids aren't going to do anything for you in a positive way as far as building muscle, right? So people look at steroids and they're like, oh, well, you go pop a magic pill. It's just completely unrealistic. You know, that's decades of hard work, decades of counting every single calorie you eat and tracking every single workout by the second, you know, it's an extreme amount of work to get there and popping a pill isn't going to make, isn't going to take all that work away. And people have this unrealistic expectation that that's what happens. Brian, were you a noble natty? Did Were you ever like prideful no. about being natty? No, you were always- No, no. Me. Yeah, I think I started taking steroids when I was like 18. I didn't care. I mean- Wait a second, I, you're 35, you said? Yeah. You're 35 and you started when you're 18 and you're not dead yet? That goes against no, all of what the media says. 